Alright, just wanted to make a video giving you my reaction and what I think about these Georgia Guidestones being blown up in an apparent explosion. And basically the fact is about these Georgia Guidestones is that they were essentially just some kind of, they were uh, undercover essentially, it was a subliminal Illuminati promotion of the essentially globalist New World Order, which is by the way prophesied in Revelation chapter 13. But these Georgia Guidestones were just simply an Illuminati monument, I do believe that. Uh, they were a monument to globalism to the new world order obviously and like i said it is prophesied in revelation 13 but these georgia these georgia guide stones being blown up uh and people call it the american stonehenge and everything else uh i wouldn't really call it that because stonehenge while it being a pagan idol is actually a bit creative at least it's at least a bit creative i'll put it that way but these georgia guide stones all they were were just an illuminati monument to globalism and really you know whether or not it was divine uh, justice or, or divine wrath that these things were destroyed. Uh, I'm not really sad about it. For one thing, I personally, I, I don't. I, I personally, not only am I not sad about it, I think it's actually pretty great. This Illuminati, uh, satanic, Freemasonic monument was, you know, destroyed and blown up. Uh, because if America truly is a Christian nation, then they shouldn't have this kind of these Illuminati Freemasonic monuments showing in the first place. But the bottom line is, is that, you know, and who knows? This could be a false flag. You never know. But. The bottom line is that the monument is gone now, and I'm not sad about it. I'm happy about it because, uh, again, it's a satanic Illuminati monument to the ideology of globalism and the New World Order prophesied in Revelation 13. So, just a quick video in my response to the whole thing. I might do more stuff on it in the future, but yeah, just my thoughts on the whole thing. Uh, not sad about it. I'm happy about it. Uh, these Georgia Guidestones were a satanic idol. So anyway, don't be deceived by anyone, anyone who tries, tries to make it seem like they're the American Stonehenge. Because like I said, Stonehenge was actually creative. At least creative. Despite being a pagan idol. Uh, the Georgia Guidestones were lazily de uh, designed at best. So anyway, don't be deceived. May the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ be with all the brethren. Goodbye.